Okay, uh, Vicki Church asks about comments on the inactive question mark, La Nacion Fault, that follows part of 54th Street that runs south. It runs south almost down to the Mexican border. This is a fault zone that doesn't get talked about as much. First off, she puts parenthetically, act, uh, inactive question mark. I personally consider it to be an active fault. It's not a primary fault. The Rose Canyon Fault is pulling the land apart. That's why we have San Diego Bay. The land has been pulled apart. So as the land drops down to make San Diego Bay, it has to rupture and separate from the rest of the San Diego, Chula Vista area. And that's the La Nacion Fault, what we call down to the basin faults. San Diego Bay is dropping down. And the bad news is a lot of homes in that, I'm going to say greater Chula Vista, National City area, a lot of them have been built over the fault strands, which should not have happened, but it has happened. Uh, so I say treat that fault with respect. Uh, do not build on top of it. I don't know if you're legally allowed to now. You were not. It was legal even a short time ago, but uh, it definitely is an active fault. It's not going to make an earthquake as big as we get on the Rose Canyon Fault or Elsinore, maybe something in the magnitude fives, but that's going to do damage to a home built on top of it.